XRP and XLM are down big. We also have Bitcoin and Ethereum suffering major losses as well. So what's happening right now? Well, people are starting to price in the Fed's decision. Market insiders know that the Fed is going to drop a big hammer. It appears that the market is pricing in a 100 basis point hit. So let's leave this screen and go into this. And we got XLM up on the board right now, 10.4 cents down 7% EOS on the screen, down 11.5%. But wait a minute, XRP down 35 cents, down 7.5%. But the big losers dragging the entire market down, Ethereum right now sitting at 13.14, down 8.4% in Bitcoin, nowhere near the 20,000 mark, everyone, down 6% in the last 24 hours to 18,773. So what is happening right now? What is going on, everyone? Well, the buy the dip sentiment is rising, yep, and it all has to do with the Fed. CPI data came out, it was, nasty. Now the Fed is going to be out here in two days. Yes, on Wednesday. And don't worry, we're going to have a live stream to cover the announcement. But the market right now is pricing in a 100 basis point hit. This would be the biggest rate hike in 40 plus years, everyone. And that can shake the market. So what we're seeing right now is the insiders pricing that action. Now take a look at this, okay? Got the chart of XLM up on the screen. You can see we were doing pretty good, 11 and a half, 11.5 cents. But we have now dropped back down almost 10% in the last 24 hours, everyone. I wanna share with you just a couple of my observations. Before every major correction, you're seeing many pumps like this where people are driving it up, taking the profit and sending it on down days before the announcement. Yes, everyone, it is buy the rumor, sell the news. Huge move there in the downside. Now, if we zoom out, we can see that XLM has serious, serious support at the 10 cent level. So for those of you out there looking to buy the dip on bad macroeconomic news like CPI data, like Jerome Powell and the Fed jacking up rates, this may be another good opportunity for you because panic is gonna set in because yes, a lot of us know that a big rate hike is coming, but there's still a bunch of people out there that are like, no, we're only gonna see a 50, no, only a 25, nope. Your world is going to get rocked when the Fed drops a 75 and most likely a 100 basis point hit. Now, if we move on over to XRP, you can see the exact same thing in the charts here. At least a 15% drop in the last 24 hours. Again, market insiders are pricing in the action that's about to happen. And let me know in the comments down below, is your strategy to buy the dip? What are you doing during this market turmoil? Every time we have these big macroeconomic events out, the price is getting rocked with market fear. Are you taking advantage or are you sitting out on sidelines waiting for things to get a little bit more clear? Now the XRP floor story is a little bit different. We saw two attempts to breach the 30 cent mark, but right now we have been holding very strong on that 32 cent floor. Again, if you want to buy the dip, look for macroeconomic events like this to shake out the weak holders in the market. But what we have to consider right now is how much more pain do we have left? And yes, investors are in to buy the dip. And I think that's what's all we have left right now. I don't know how much more new money is going to get into the market, but those of us that are trying to DCA, those of us that are trying to buy in the dip and make some short or long-term positions here, we're the ones getting back into the market. Is XRP performing? bad? No, they're not. They had an 800% increase in ODL service usage in quarter two of 2021 versus 2022. Yes, during the crypto winter. And what about Stellar? Is their performance down? No, we have seen record breaking transactions on the chain. But remember everyone, individual personal performance of a crypto right now is having little to no effect on the market. The market right now is paying attention to Jerome Powell and the Fed and their Wednesday announcement on how many points that they're going to jack up the market. Don't worry, I'm going to be covering it with a live stream and look to see you there. If you want to learn more about cool crypto stuff, check out this video right here. Thank you everyone for watching. I truly appreciate all of your support. We're going to keep on this grind and keep you informed and have a great rest of your day.